So let's talk about this DVD. It's about smoke, and it's not about your average smoke situation. Not at all, not at all. It's not the, hey, we just getting high to get high, and this is what it's about. Oh, no, 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 it's informative, man. It's a, this is a reason why there's, there's this kind of smoke out there, and people are attracted to this smoke, mm -hmm. and for whatever reason. It's real informative, man. It's real like, you know, what you smoking on, you know, from city to city, from Miami to LA. From the bay, you know, the, the dispensaries, you know, you can legally, you know, just walk in the store, look on the menu and say, let, let me get an ounce of that Kush, an ounce of that Haze, and an ounce of this, and just, they give it to you in a paper bag, yeah. and you walk out, so you're going to actually see that on the DVD. That's you know, you're going to take us in the store, you're going to show us the medical cards, so, like, it's a it's a change in the world right now, you know, or in the country. You know, like, a lot of states, even here in Mass, you know what I mean? You can walk around with an ounce of marijuana in your pocket, it's just a ticket. You know, That's crazy. So the laws are changing. So with that being said, it was time. You no, know, we caught up with the Rick Rosses and the Young Jeezy. You know, of course they're gonna tell us what they're smoking on and, and how they roll it and what they smoke it in and things of that nature. But we really want the, the people to be a fact, to be the part of this. So you know, we really want to talk to the people. Check it out, Chuck. We caught up with the chef. So it was crazy because he was in, he was in the <laughs> kitchen, right? And he was like he was like slicing it up, like slicing his cannabis up or his buds up with a knife, a real cooking knife, like a big cooking knife, slicing it up, up breaking it all the way down, and puts it in the butter and shows you what you need. He gives you the whole ingredients so you can make some nice chocolate chip kush cookies. So it was like real informative, man, teaching you how to vaporize where you don't smoke and you know like the smoke from a, um, a blunt rack and kind of like it's not good. It's like cigarettes, right. but vaporizing is so healthy. Because there's no smoke, it's like breathing air. You know, you go to the mall, you suck that air, and it's supposed to. So it's so pure, and it takes all the, you know, everything bad that's in the cannabis out of it. So you wow. know, we, we're giving you information like that in the DVD. So what you're smoking on is really, really informative, man. And um, if you smoke, you're gonna love it. If you don't smoke, you're gonna learn something. I imagine a place that I would like to see, a place I would like to be. I think about it every day and night before I go to sleep. It's a feeling I feel that burns in my body about a place I never been. It's a fantasy on my mind about this place. First one's humble. This is the Jack. This is the lemon. This is the this is the MK Ultra, and this is the Grape Ape. These two guys are 55. This guy is 54, and these guys down here are in the 36 range. This is what we smoke, right here. That's what we smoke. It's some of that good granddad and the, and the good sour grapes. When you say purple weed, this is what they're talking about. This is the land of the purple weed. You know, if you don't have purple weed, we don't want it. You know, if it's green, the best green bud you ever had, we don't even want that. There's a lot of hype and popularity surrounding the purple strains. Mm -hmm. And I mean, I think that's part of it is, you know, whatever's popular or is hot. But there's also, there's a reason that it's so popular. And a lot of the strains have higher THC content. You know, the OG Purple Kush and the, the Granddaddy, um, those may have, you know, four to seven percent higher THC levels. So it's strong and that's why you got the smell. You know, some of the purple now is actually where, where the growers turn the temperatures down in the grow rooms to make it turn, the plant actually turn purple. That's, you know, it, it moves, but that's not actually the, the real true purple, you know, like the Kush or the OG stuff. You see it's fogged out in here, we smoked out, we loving it. You know I'm smoking on no Fruit Loops. This ain't no Captain Crunch. It's that real deal, baby. <laughs>